5.30 a.m. and I just wanted to give you a quick porch update. The temperature is about 55 degrees. Not terrible. <laughs> What's up, guys? Ah, a little morning coffee. So I had big plans this morning. I was gonna go out and I was gonna go into the woods and I was gonna go hiking and I was gonna take some pictures and I didn't do that. However, I did get up and make coffee and I watered the lawn. So I guess I got a little bit done, but not everything I wanted to. Oh well. So the plan today, I think we're gonna take the kids on their very first fishing expedition and get them to try to catch some fish. I wonder if they're gonna touch them. Michelle might. I don't know about Miles. That sun is bright today. I tried to find a place over in the shade. I don't know how well I did, but whatever. I'm excited to go fishing today. I haven't been fishing in years. I'm gonna go break out the old fishing rods. So I found the fishing rods, and actually I forgot. I bought the kids their own fishing rods a couple of years ago, and we never used them. And here's my fishing rod. You might be asking yourself, why do we have a tent set up in the garage? Well, that's a really good question. It's because we were letting the kids play in the tent outside when it was really hot the other day. So they come outside and they'd run around, and then they go back in the tent and cool off a little bit and then come back outside. The weather has changed and it's not that hot anymore. However, the past couple of days, it was like 90 degrees outside, which is unprecedented. Especially because the weather a couple of days before that was like 40 and 50. It doesn't make any sense. Come on, New England. So I wanted to show you guys something that's really cool that I got. Amanda got me this. Walt Disney World, 1,367 miles, but I actually think that it's that way. And I don't know if you've been following along, but the hole in the wall is still not fixed. The question now is, will it ever be fixed? Gotta wait for the light to adjust here as we walk outside. So I wanted to talk a minute about procrastination. I'm a habitual procrastinator. Case in point, that wall still isn't fixed. And it's been weeks. But! This week, my car died, or so I thought, and I thought it was the alternator. Oh, it's Amanda! Hi, Hi Amanda! I you just did! Hello! Get coffee and come out! Oh, bring my coffee too! I forgot mine. Anyway, my car, I thought, died this week. We had some trouble and it wasn't starting, and I assumed that the, the battery was the problem, and it was the alternator that went. So, Something that I never do is I went out right away. I bought an alternator and I also got stuff for an oil change and it turns out I just had a loose connection on a battery that I replaced three months ago. If I had waited and had somebody look at it before I bought the materials, I wouldn't have gone out and spent the money on it. Now I have to take it back and return it. So maybe sometimes procrastination isn't so bad. Did you bring me coffee? I did. Oh, I'm so happy. I couldn't find your Wait a minute. <laughs> This is a kiss the girl mug. This isn't my stitch mug. I can't find it. I love that mug. This is my favorite. I wish I had a nice mug. Ah, nothing like coffee, eh, Amanda? Nothing like it. Turned out to be an unbelievably nice day out today, right? Yeah, it's really nice. I can't though. believe it. So I think I'm pretty dead set on going out into the woods and going fishing. Oh, fun! Yeah, you want to go? Yes. Do you want to go fishing? Are we go fishing with your friends? Maybe, but okay. do you actually want to go fishing? I have four fishing rods. Yeah. And you, you're you going to put a worm on the hook? No, you're going to do that for me. And if you catch a fish, you're going to take the fish off your hook? Nope, you're going to do that for me. This sucks. <laughs> Guys. Yeah? Are you ready to go fishing today? Yes. How excited are you to go fishing for the first I'm time in forever? I'm very excited. You're 100 excited? We've never been. So. I know. All right, eat up some breakfast, because then we're going to go for a hike through the woods. And fishing. There you are. I found my coffee cup. Where was it? It was in the garage. I left it out there when I went to get the fishing stuff. Well, that makes sense. Uh huh. What do you guys think of your fishing rods? Cool. Is that good? Yeah. Is that one mine. Sure. If you want that one to be yours, what do you think of your 
Your fishing tote. I love it. Your tackle box. It's not a tackle box. You it's have called a tackle box. You have a big one. Check it out. Look at this. I know. You open this up. All your stuff is right under there. We know. We, we figured that out. You figured it out already? Yeah. Are you going to touch the worms? Yeah. Are you going to touch the fish? No. All right. We got to go find some worms before we get there. Mm. Come on. Hurry up. Watch. Holy guacamole, there is a lot of pollen on my car. Wow, that's insane. Whoa. We have arrived. Are you guys ready? Yeah. We found worms. We got fishing rods. We got tackle boxes. I'm so excited. What do you guys think of some woods walking B-roll? I think we found our fishing spot right here. You guys ready? Yeah. All right, come on down. For now. For now. We might move on in a little bit. Oh. All right, sir. Your hook is on. What I'm gonna need you to do is dig in here and grab a worm. Go ahead, I'll hold it, you dig it. Just grab one worm and pull it out. There you go, you got it. Pull it, pull it, pull it. Nice. And then you throw it. Okay? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then you just kind of let it sit there. Okay. And it's going to hang out, okay? Okay. All right, here you go. Here's your fishing rod. All right, Michelle. Same deal. Here's the hook. You got to pick your own worm. Whoa! Oh that's my huge. God. That is going to be lunch for one of these guys. Oh, that's a good one. Well, nice. No bites yet, except the little kibbies. But you know what? Look at the view we have. It's beautiful. We didn't catch it on camera, but Miles, you just caught a fish, didn't you? Yeah. Michelle? You, got one. you caught a little teeny tiny fish. Bring it in. There we go. It's just a little little sunfish. <laughs> but you caught it! Yeah! Yay! Yay! Can I see? And in a row. two right in a row with our next fish. You got three in a row. Three fish? In a row. Three little sunfish. Fish on. Oh! Look at that. We got another one. Another one? What? They just don't stop. Michelle, you are on fire, honey. No way. All right. Here you go. Real, real, real. Whoa, Miles! How does it feel to catch a fish? That's it! We're done fishing. I think we caught fish in the double digits. Yeah. Michelle caught, how many did you catch, like seven? Maybe. Eight? Eight, could have eight years old. Yeah, Miles, you caught two, three? Um, two. Two, mommy, you caught? Zero. Yeah, mommy didn't fish because she's afraid of worms and afraid of fish. <laughs> so I, yeah! Gotta watch where I'm going. So that was really fun. I didn't know the kids would like it so much. And Michelle? I love it. Michelle loves fishing. It's so fun. It is so fun. So, so now I think, watch where you're going too. <laughs> All right, we gotta watch where we're going. We're going to get lunch.